POLICE CALL IT ONE OF THE BIGGEST UNDERAGE DRINKING BUSTS IN A LONG TIME. 70 JUVENILES CITED WITH MINOR IN POSSESSION AT A WEEKEND PARTY IN MILLARD. NOW MORE PUNISHMENT COULD BE COMING. KTV NEWS WATCH 7'S ALEXANDER STONE IS LIVE. Citation reports from Omaha police indicate at least one of the students cited for minor in possession could be on the Millard West basketball roster. Now, with the team set to compete in the state tournament, Millard Public School spokeswoman Rebecca Kleeman tells me the team will still compete, but there could be some changes to that roster. This is really a large incident. And we haven't had one like this in a very long time that even comes close to this. A big party ends in a big bust with 70 juveniles cited for minor in possession. Sergeant Tony Gutierrez says officers responded to a call Saturday night just after 10 p.m. Reports came in that there was about 100 people uh, with 20 to 25 cars parked in front of the residence and that there was a party. Citation reports from Omaha police reference minors taking breathalyzer tests and showing alcohol in their systems. Several of the citations list Saturday's incident as a second offense. One minor is quoted as saying she didn't know what she was drinking. It's all of this Sergeant Gutierrez says they're working to prevent. We send officers out driving around looking for them. Uh, we also have um, a tip line specifically for minors in possession through social media. We have officers that track the social media networks out there to see where these uh, MIP parties are going to be taking place. And Gutierrez says they're glad Saturday night didn't turn into something much worse. We're lucky in this case that it didn't lead to anything further. Right now it's 70 minor in possession of alcohol arrests. It's not knocking on somebody's door of why their son or daughter's dead. No one from Millard Public Schools would go on camera, but spokeswoman Rebecca Kleeman says they've had a number of students self-report. The schools will get a full list from police and follow up with the students cited. The Millard School Code of Conduct says under possession of drugs and alcohol, students can be suspended from extracurriculars for up to 19 days. If they choose to take a course, that can be reduced to 10 days. The state tournament starts on Thursday. Hey, Alexander, what does the Nebraska School Activities Association have to say about this? Rob, the NSAA says it leaves all of that disciplinary action up to the individual districts. Okay, I understand. Alexander Stone reporting live. Thanks. Now, as for that state tournament,